hey y'all and welcome back to my channel so i am quickly doing this video i just had to pick up the little one from school which it was like the end of the day so she only had like maybe about 45 minutes left of school but they called me and told me that she wasn't feeling good and literally when she hit the door she fell asleep i gave her some tylenol she fell asleep so this will be a perfect time because this is friday the seventh and i kind of want to get this video up at least by the weekend or sometime that way you guys can get ideas on what to get your little one um heck if you don't get them anything at all they should be grateful enough that you love them right <laughs> and you brought them into this world and they're here but um i didn't go all out this year you guys i'm not going all out for the simple fact that halo still has christmas toys that she ain't open yeah i'm not going all out this is stuff that i picked up like a while back a few weeks ago when i seen they was bringing out valentine's day stuff so i just grabbed a little something for her you know because she actually you know loves getting gifts and toys and stuff i literally can like rewrap some of her christmas gifts and she wouldn't even know nothing honey mm. if you like me food for thought okay but it's just some things I've seen. And you know, we as parents, you just pick it up. You think about your baby. Every time I go in the store, I'm thinking about my baby. So, um, no rhyme or reason. No special type of theme or anything like this. I just hope that whatever you guys see in this video, maybe you can take it, pick up the same things, critique it, how do it, however you choose to. Um, it's all up to you. And besides... It's a man-made holiday. We love our kids 24-7, right? No rhyme or reason, but I believe the first thing that I picked up is this cute little thing. When I seen it, I just knew I wanted her to have it. I think it's super cute, super adorable. And I'm going to press this now because it does sing. It's called a singing, Valentine's singing flamingo. It was $16 at Big Lots. However, I got a percentage off. I believe it was like 25% or 20% off family friends day, something like that. So I did get 20% off of this, so I didn't pay that for it. But I just thought it was a super cute with the little legs and everything. When Halo goes into the stores, she really liked playing with these dolls. So um, I knew I wanted to get it for her. Uh, just instead of like the plain old teddy bear, something a little bit different. Where does it? Oh, here we go. It has like a breath. Oh, wait a minute. Is it not working? Oh, it's off. Okay. And I'm going to do this because she's downstairs sleeping. I want to be loved by you, just you. keep going <laughs> but i thought it was so cute if y'all know that song i love like betty boo growing up as a kid you know oops oh, baby okay go go in your room mommy's doing a video <gasps> close the door oh my goodness i almost got busted but anyway on to the next and I am getting my oldest daughters something as well uh, so they better not be looking at this video if they are then that's just gonna be too bad but I always like to get them like a little sweet treat so I got these little um, what are these Lindora candies them the same age because they only like a year apart so got them that and then i and i also got them this thing this right here waiting for it to come in the mail y'all i just my my daughters are dealing with separation i think a lot of it is like separation anxiety they grew up together they all that's all they knew was one another and then however when luxury went off into the military I think it, it it really did. It put a damper on their relationship. Um, even me with my daughter. Because it's always been just the three of us. Um, 
so they've been having little rough patches but i got this to help them remind themselves but one thing about it is that i teach my kids that you guys are all you got that came out of this hoo-ha so you're gonna feel you're gonna fight that's what families do but at the end of the day you better know how to come together. You're gonna always love your sister. You pick up that phone and you call her. And since Luxury been here, it's like, it's still the same. You know, they, they go back to their childhood. So they, they still in the process of transitioning from kids until adulthood. And then they both, I'm grown too. You know how that is. So, yeah, so that's what I got for them. Something very, very special to always remind them both that you guys are sisters and you never forget it. You know, I, I get on my kids. They know I, I get on it. Okay. I don't play that. But anyway, I picked this up for the little mama. Just a little sweet treat. But she don't have no problem um, being an annoying little sister. That never fails. <laughs> when Luxury came here, she got a dose of reality. I also picked her up these because... She had some the other day and she really get a kick out of like the little emoji faces. Like she loves to get on the phone and any and everybody phone and look for the little puppy face. She loves this stuff. So when I seen this, I thought it'd be perfect for her. And then I also got her this retro kiss tech. Y'all, it was like a dollar something, and I just picked it up. Like, stuff like this is what you put in a little basket. So, um, I do remember seeing this, like, during the Christmas season, but they had it marked down. So, she's into, like, these little keychains and things on her backpack. So, I don't know what it does. Maybe you can reseal with the kids series. I don't know. Collect. I don't know what this is. It holds pictures. I don't know, but I guess we'll figure all that out later. Kissable keychain or one postcard sticker. Okay. So, yeah. She like, like I said, she loves little stuff like that to put on her backpack. Of course, I, this is what we're going to put it in. Everything's going to go in there. I also picked up this, and I'm glad I did, this, this hedgehog light. We was in Target maybe about last week or, or so, and she seen this and she thought this was so cute. However, they do have different colors and different characters, um, but I thought this would be cute when I redo her room because I will be redoing her room in the future. I'm not doing it now because Luxury's in there, so it's like Luxury's room, but I will be redoing her room in the future and she'll have a little nightlight. I don't know what happened to the card. Oh, here it is. Y'all, literally, this card is from last year. So I took it out the drawer to make sure she get it this year. <laughs> Recycle, okay? Recycle. I totally forgot. So I put it in the bag to make sure she gets it this year. And I got her this little heart. And y'all see who's on there? Frozen. Mm -hmm. Once again, she likes little stuff like this. So, just a little something. You know, nothing really, really big. I'm not doing no clothes or anything like that. I'm just not doing it, y'all. I'm not doing it. This right here um, is very, very sentimental to me. I need to get this for my oldest girls, actually, because this is something that my dad would get them. When he was alive, every time he would see them, is these uh, Tootsie Roll Pops. The reason why I got this is because um, Halo's been seeing my dad. Uh, so, she never seen him before. But, I know his spirit is around her. So, I got these. Send them to me. She don't know about it. But, you guys get the drift of it. I also picked up these Cento's um, rainbow pens because Halo loves to doodle, scribble, write little love notes. And this one actually has it to wear projecting pens where it has all the different colors on it. Y'all remember these? 
If you a like a 80s baby, 70s babies, then you definitely know about these. Um, so, and it's scented, so I thought that was pretty good. She did get the scented markers and she loves them. So, I picked this up. I don't remember where, maybe Target, but it was a dollar. Um, I do plan on getting her another little um, journal. I picked up one yesterday, but we was in the store and Luxury spilled some water on it. So, soda or something. I can't remember. So, I left it, but I have to get her another one this week. And the last thing that I got her was two different bath bombs. You know, Target has these for a dollar. I don't buy these very often for her. Just every once in a while, special occasion. So, what I plan on doing on Valentine's Day for her um is to get her a nice full bubble bath and mommy's i'm gonna get the little flower petals put them in a bathtub nice soap and she can just sit and relax so that's what mommy's gonna do for her and have her a little cup of um her little juice and everything in a bathtub and just let her relax so that's what I'm going to do for my little one. I try to do something special for her every year. My oldest girls, not so much because they are adults, but I do try to think of something to get them, especially now that Luxury's here and I ain't got to ship nothing. So that's what was on my heart to get my oldest daughters, um, just to remind them, you know, how mommy feel about certain things. So this is all the things I got for Halo. I would love to see what you guys got your little one. If you do a video, definitely tag me in it or hit me up on Instagram. Here is my Instagram page where you guys can um, message me and tell me or show me even pictures. Send me pictures. I love to see it. Um, it just makes me happy when you guys do that. So I hope, like I said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it gives you some ideas or inspiration on what to do for your little one, that special someone in your life. And I hope you all have a happy Valentine's Day. Until then, I will talk to you later because the other one just opened her door. All right, bye.